So I'm sitting here with a friend and I've been reminiscing over, I'll just say the loss of a potential relationship. And I ended up calling the shot because I realized that this person really wasn't carrying the integrity of his words matching his actions that I needed him to have. And it was an interesting decision and victory because I called the shot for my own reasons. And being a mercy-minded person, that was a huge victory for me. But the struggle was, I still have this person on my mind. And I'm trying to discern did I make the right decision? Did I make the wrong decision? Was there still something there? Did I interpret it correctly? And then I started relating it to a champion mindset in golf. And that's what I do. I teach mental toughness, how to recover from a bad shot and quickly engage to the next shot. And I always say champions are those that can turn a disempowering emotion into an empowering emotion at will. So all of a sudden the thought occurred to me is that when you make the decision to move on, you have to let go of the bad shot or the shot that didn't measure up or the shot that you took in good intention but it landed in the sand trap. And then to go back and think about, well, maybe I should replay that shot or you know that lingering emotion. No, the shot was the shot and it's over. So the more quickly you can recapture and repossess your energy to take into the next shot and accept it, process it, gain the lesson from it, and let the rest go, the more you're gonna be in a place to receive a great shot. And so as I've been asking myself, why is this person still in my mind? Like, how do you interpret that? You can dig deep or you can say, hey, it's time to let the shot be the shot. It's over. And go back, go back to that positive mental attitude for the expectation of the next shot. So I don't know who I'm speaking to, but if you can relate it all, a champion is someone that can turn a disempowering emotion into an empowering motion at will. So the quicker that you can do that and leave it, leave the shot in the shot and don't take it to the next shot, the better position you'll be to get that relationship that you really deserve. And who would have known that all this info about golf and mental toughness would improve my relationship game. So I hope that helps you too.